All right, welcome back to another Sneak of the Week. Got two players for you this week, both on DraftKings and one of them on FanDuel. Let's jump right into it. First player is Isaiah Williams, Illinois. They're a 23 and a half point dog at Penn State. Not a great implied team total. Last week he saw 12 targets. He's averaging 8.85 targets a game. He has a floor of about six fantasy points. It's the lowest he scored all year. If he gets a touchdown in this, he's going to be a great value play. He's getting the targets no matter what. On their team, he has 62 targets. The next highest is 30. 29.5% target share. Illinois is going to be behind and having to throw the ball this game. For DraftKings, just on PPR alone, I think he's a great value play at 3.7 thousand. He's also available on FanDuel's main slate, five and a half if you really need him, but that they don't have PPR. They have half PPR, so not as great of a play there. If he gets a touchdown and they're really only suspected to get one, he's going to be a great addition. Next player from the Purdue Boilermakers coming off that real nice, beautiful upset of the Iowa Hawkeyes. Purdue's coming in at a three and a half point dog against Wisconsin at home. The implied team total is around 20. Milton Wright wasn't really in the plans at the start of the year, but the last four games, he has been one of their main guys. He's averaged 13.6 fantasy points a game in those last four games. Seven and a half targets each game. Not much to say about this other than the game script goes his way, where it's going to be close. He gets the targets in PPR for DraftKings. If he gets a touchdown, another killer play, just like Isaiah Williams. I think 4.2 thousand on DraftKings is very low for the upside and the targets that this guy gets each week. Thanks for watching. You got two guys there. Wouldn't recommend playing them together. They're pretty touchdown dependent, but they have really nice floors. Lock them in. Let's go for those touchdowns, and I'll see you next week.